Good morning, my YouTube friends. Saturday morning. Uh, went to breakfast with my son. That was fun. It's like 7.20. Gotta get ready for my class. Realized that my hair needs to be combed. <laughs> anyway. There was a fast food restaurant that we went to. His choice this morning. And, uh... I, hold on, I really have to stop doing that. I screw the cop on so hard that I can't open it up with one hand. <laughs> so, anyway, that was, that was good. I'm, I was glad to have that with him. Um, we didn't get a chance to eat inside because I went to one restaurant, one of these fast food restaurants who will remain nameless, um, cause they don't pay me. <clears throat> uh, and it was closed. It's six o'clock in the morning. Really? You serve breakfast. <laughs> so we went to another one, tried to open the door, locked. And great, because we like to sit down. I don't really eat breakfast. I just sit down with him while he eats his breakfast. So I went through the drive-thru. The drive-thru was open. So I got his breakfast, came back. Got myself a cup of coffee. Cause I still, even though I have a coffee maker, I don't have coffee here, and uh, I don't know. I, I figure I'm, I'm still testing out this bulletproof coffee thing. So at some point, I will pull the coffee maker out and buy some coffee and that sort of thing. But so I got coffee there, and I put in my blender, you know, the coffee and the <clears throat> tablespoon of heavy cream and. The, tablespoon of curry gold and the tablespoon of coconut oil right hit the blend here's what it looks like frothy goodness yes frothy goodness yes frothy sort of goodness not as good as it was before anyway so i pour it out into my container there and i look at the bottom and there are dregs in the bottom I'm like really fast food people really People buy coffee in the morning and this is what you serve them and you know it was like one of the first pots of the day because you know apparently they don't open until six o'clock in the morning like really I don't want to drink drinks <laughs> I should have poured it through a strainer but I guess I'll get some drinks today anyway today's a busy day got my class to teach I need to go get ready my hair a little better maybe fix the makeup because it's not looking that great I didn't it's from yesterday I didn't bother to take it off I know that's bad I know I know and I got sight and sound so I think that I might do one big um, one big meal because I'm gonna teach and then I'm going to go to the gym. And when I come back, it should be about noon. So I might do one big meal today. I'm thinking that might be what I do. Because I'm, I'm, I gotta leave at four for the sight and sound trip. So. So that's my day. What you guys doing today? Let me know. See you later. Good afternoon, my YouTube friends. How y'all doing? It's like, I don't know, 1.30. I've got some hair sticking up. Oh, that's what happens when you go to the gym and yank your hair up in a ponytail. <laughs> anyway, uh, I'm hungry and uh, I was going to try to eat all my calories, all my carbs, all my food in one meal, but I don't think that's going to happen. But I'll show you what I'm eating. Okay, so the four cups of spinach, a tablespoon of butter, and an ounce of cream cheese. Not really a surprise, because I eat that often. And I like it. It's really tasty. Um, what's in the other bowl is eight ounces of chicken breast, which was a little too lean, so I wanted to fatten it up. So, way back in the day, I used to make a white roux, which is like a white sauce, which I loved. But... It does have carbs in it. This actually has carbs in it too. So I figure I would try it in a lower carb way. So I use two tablespoons of butter, 
two tablespoons of almond flour, two tablespoons of heavy cream, and two tablespoons of water. And I cooked it. And you cook it, you melt the butter, put the flour in, let it join, bind together, whatever, and then you put the water stuff in. And if it was too thick, I would put more water in it. Um, so I stirred it up and uh, put a little seasoning in it and poured it over the chicken. And I tasted it. And it tastes awesome. <laughs> I'm like, I'll be doing this again. This tastes good. Because I was trying to figure out, like I have ground chicken, I'm like, yeah, that's a little too lean. So that is what I'm doing. Now, I kind of think I'm going to be back. I'm not exactly sure when I'll be back. Um, I'm supposed to be leaving earlier this later on a couple hours to go to Sight and Sound tonight. So if I remember, I'll try to put a little clip in. Anyway, I will see you guys later.